What is up? What's Hold up, me. guys? I am dead to the world today. <laughs> and I have no makeup on, so excuse me for looking a little bit shabby today. But I was called out to work this morning at 3 a.m. Shane's on call. I'm on call at work, so I got called out at 3 a.m. this morning. So I am a little bit tired. And I did, literally got ready and left the house in five minutes. So this did not get done today. And she stinks. No, I don't. I have deodorant on. But I did not have time to take a shower, so sorry, y'all. <laughs> um, so today was a long day. Kurt and I left work just a couple of hours early. A, because I am really tired. And B, we have an adventure we're going on. What is our adventure? We're gonna go look at the place we want to, that we're interested in possibly to move to. Yep. Um, so we're gonna meet there and tour one that is already model. built and finished and we're gonna tour that and go through it because we've been through the smaller model, um, but we want the larger model. So we're gonna go tour through that and see what we like, what's available and see if it is going to be an option for us or not. We'll see. It'll be interesting, I know that. We're excited, like, Very excited. really excited. It's interesting. So they're putting in the park today, it looks like, at the community that we are looking at. Oh, it looks nice. It looks nice. It's gonna be really big, so this whole thing is gonna be all like grass and stuff for the park, they said. Man, I wanted to take you to the place we just looked at, but, we, we're, gonna, we're gonna keep you guys in suspense just a little bit longer. Yeah, we, we there's what we decided. I think is we're gonna show you our final decision, yeah. and maybe talk to you through a couple things. Um, now, right now, without going into a ton of detail, I think what our main where the places that we want to buy is, and like we what want direction the home is going to be. That's what really big. So like right now, our home faces east and west, which in turn makes it so the house gets pretty warm in the evening. No, it's like a deal breaker or anything. We want that. We want a little bit of a view if we could. Um, Basically like where this place is, is it's kind of up on a hill. So depending on the location of the lot and what we buy, where we buy, it could potentially look over like the entire city of yeah. Salt Lake. So instead of like looking into somebody else's house, I think we would like to look, have like a little bit more openness, which when you guys find out a little bit more, I think it will make a lot more oh, well, okay. sense. Um, so I think that's kind of what we're geared towards right now. I'm trying to get with our real estate agent to see what's available with the new builder. Right. Um, because I'm, the new builder wasn't there uh, in the model home. So we can ask them questions today. So that's And then kinda... we're also waiting still back on like an appraisal for our home to know what we can list ours at to know how much we can upgrade on the new home, things like that. So hopefully we should have that by tomorrow. Exciting stuff. So we stopped and picked up Jax from school. Shailene had to stop at work for a little bit again because they got really busy, but um, Jax, what was the surprise after school? Uh, what is it? A Slurpee. A Slurpee, it is so delicious. <laughs> well, good. He's been really good this week, and I know that he's been begging one for a little bit, and so I decided it's time to stop and get him one because he loves them so much. Cereal, two nights in a row. That's what happens when you're busy. Shailene is beat though. I keep telling her to go take a nap and rest, but but she won't. Um, got like the office and this room pretty much clean. Got a couple things on the ground still that we want to get rid of. Um, Jax's toys, but office is pretty much done. I just need to, only thing I need to do is vacuum. But everything else looks great. So got all cleaned up. This all organized, nice. <sighs> looks good. I just need to straighten this though too. I think it looks good. <laughs> Shane's dead asleep. <laughs> Are you pretty tired tonight, babe? Yeah. So I'm sitting here watching Big Brother and Shailene is dead asleep. Actually, not dead asleep, she just barely started snoozing. She said she's gonna watch Big Brother and then she's gonna go to sleep. Trying, trying real hard, huh? I'm tired. Yep, so Big Brother's really good this year. Like, I think it's like better than like quite a few years in the past, wouldn't you say? It's really good. Yeah, she says that, but she's like, I'm not gonna watch it, I'm gonna sleep. 
Yeah, if you guys and watch Big Brother, about, who do you like? And they're talking about ice cream, and now I want ice cream really bad. You have to be awake to eat ice cream. Man, it's been a stressful, long, fun-filled, full night of cleaning, talking with our realtor, getting a bunch of stuff worked out, and we just, I can, I, I, I like the house buying process, but it is a pain. Mm -hmm. Especially when trying to build. But like one of like the, the properties we want just isn't available, and the next one isn't gonna be available for like six months or so, and we're not sure if we wanna, we wanna wait, wait that long, so we're trying to outweigh a bunch of options and just get it all taken care of and just figured out. This lighting is awesome. Look at that, ooh, it's weird. Nothing can really fix this today. Mm-hmm, ooh, sexy. No, not even close. <sighs> so, I just remember, like, I wish it was just as easy as like, going to a property and just say, okay, let's buy it. Next day, you know, get a quick loan and buy it, you know? But the house buying process is just painful, mm -hmm. regardless, wouldn't you say? Uh-huh. Don't. I thought you were gonna give me a wet willy. <laughs> I just don't know what to do. It, what's hard is, a lot of times, too, is it's a big decision when it comes to home buying because it's a, it's a life decision. It's not just, you know, going to buy a car even, you know? It's something that you're living with, living with forever. I'm paying for for like 20 to 30 years. Yeah, and it's, it's extremely expensive. And not even just like the money side of it, it's where you live, it's where you raise your family. Is it you know, the right thing? You're gonna be raised in living like amongst the, the right people. Are your neighbor's gonna be good. Are your, you know, I don't know. It's just, yeah. it's a stressful thing, you know, to make sure you're doing the right thing for your family. I think we're making the right decision though, yeah. just because we don't have many people out where we live right now. Actually, no real friends like that we're close with, you're like close enough with to make like a big difference in regards to staying out here. And that's one of the big reasons why we kind of want to move honestly, mm -hmm. is we want to be closer to you know our good friends and good uh, family. our family and, and just have the opportunity to spend more time with each other. Yeah. You know, we're in town right now a lot, but that's just causing it to be a lot of commute time back and forth. I'm excited. I just want to wiggle my nose or snap my fingers and have it be done though. Yeah, it's just weighing the options. But anyways, wish us luck, and we'll be bringing you guys along on this process and seeing if it's, you know, really, you know, just trying to figure out what we want to do. Hopefully we'll go talk to the builder tomorrow if we have time, though. We'll see. It's just making the 45-minute drive after picking up jacks back, back to where we want to go, so. Let's leave work early again. High five. No, I can't. So anyways, we will see you guys again. Manana, peace out. Peace out. Oh, oh yeah, right there. Camera strap. <laughs> peace out. Peace out.